now, the WWE Slam of the Week is brought to you by Pathfinder, Legend of the Ghost Warrior, in theaters now. Must be a one-on-one -on -one matchup against Dave Taylor and Regal and Taylor double-teaming Kane. This matchup not officially underway. Regal with a steel chair. No effect to Kane at all. What a run by Kane driving Regal into the crowd. And look at Taylor flying across the announce table. Chaos at ringside at the hands of Kane. SmackDown, I would not want to be Davari tonight. Oh, man! Who happens to stay the ball? One fall. Coach in rank, playing in at 323 pounds. King! Well, Davari literally looks scared to death, John, and who can blame him? The last time Davari was in the ring with Kane, Kane ended up dragging him to the locker room area. We did see the remnants. We saw pictures on WWE.com of how bad Kane beat up Davari. I got one word for you, Davari. Run! Oh. Run, son! Run! And it was all because of Davari's past relationship with the great Kali, who Kane met at WrestleMania. And now Kane and Davari set for this one-on-one -on -one matchup. And Kane has just been on a terror the last couple of weeks. You saw what he did to Regal and Taylor last week. Two of the toughest guys I've ever known in my life, Regal and Taylor, and Kane decimated them by himself. So if you're Davari, beside Ron, which you offered him to do before, what would you do against Kane? Look, I'd like to say that there's a Davari has a chance. I don't think he does. I don't think there's a chance in the world anything's going to happen but that repeatedly. That right hand knocked Davari off his feet. And taking nothing away from Davari. He's a great singles wrestler as a cruiserweight, but he is in there with one of the biggest monsters of all time who is in a terrible mood, Kane. Former champion, the Big Red Machine. Devastating everything in his path as of late. And the thing about it, oh, is Kane loves this. Kane feeds off this. You saw Kane smile when he set MVP on fire. And I tell you what gets me. This crowd loves this as well. Oh! They're as bloodthirsty as Kane is. The side slam by the big red machine. He is toying with him. It's like a cat with a little wounded bird in the driveway in your house. Kane is just toying with him. You want to talk about little wounded birds? That's what happens to a bird when it runs into an engine of a 747. In the big red machine. And total control, absolute domination. Oh, another right, knocking Damari off his feet. How powerful is a man when he can knock another man off his feet with one right hand? Oh! Did you hear that? In Little League Baseball, you've got a mercy rule. When a team gets so far ahead, you just call the game and let everybody go home. I would suggest Mick Mickey Hansen use the mercy rule right now. Well, this isn't Little League. It's the WWE. It's not Little League. You think a monster like Kane would be in Little League? And Kane's it's an analogy. No oh, mercy. Kane's showing no mercy for Davari. Major League Chuck Slam. Here's the cover. Kane absolutely demolishing Davari. Yeah. Oh, look at this. Hey. What the hell? Regal and Taylor. Yeah, Regal and Taylor. Regal and Taylor, those two hooligans who Kane beat the hell out of last week, are looking for a little revenge tonight. I told you, they're two of the toughest guys I've ever seen. They don't take being beaten up too well. To them, Michael, this is just a normal weekend night. It's his payback. And Kane. And look at Taylor trying to take Kane down. And Taylor and Regal taking it to the big man. This is like a, a mugging somewhere in a back alley in London. <laughs> How much of a brute is Kane? Kane still on his feet. Oh! And 
Kane is manhandling both of them. And Taylor and Regal both sliding out of the ring. Wow. Well, Regal and Taylor saying, hey, we got the shots in tonight. But I guarantee you this is far from over, big man. That's what Regal is signaling to Kane. Kane likes it. Unbelievable. What else is unbelievable, Michael, is can the Undertaker and the Animal coexist against two guys who love to fight tonight?